This video will show you how to find and use subject guides available through OSU Libraries. Subject guides can be very useful for the research process by providing a centralized location for resources relevant to a given subject area. You can access subject guides through the quick link on the right side of the library's homepage. This is the index to the subject guides. A plus sign next to a subject means that there are more subject areas listed under that broad category, such as arts and humanities. Let's look at the subject page for philosophy. On the left side of the screen, you can see the name and contact information for the subject librarian. Notice that he is also the librarian for several subjects, which is pretty common. The headings and type of information provided on a subject guide vary from subject to subject. For philosophy, there are five different areas that are listed here. Clicking on Expand All will expand each section so that you can view the resources for that area. Under Articles and Books, you'll find links to philosophy-specific databases, such as the Philosopher's Index, databases related to subject, the subject area, such as International Medieval Bibliography, and more general databases, such as JSTOR. Clicking on any title will take you to that resource. Under Philosophy Reference, we find reference books, such as encyclopedias and dictionaries. The Philosophy Subject Guide also has links to useful review sources and dissertation and theses databases. Dissertations and theses are typically not published anywhere else but in these databases. The Philosophy Librarian also provides a regular update of new library acquisitions related to the subject of philosophy. He provides the call number, author, title, and keywords. Please note that most subject guides do not provide these type of updates. Thank you for watching this video. Please explore the other tutorials available through OSU Libraries.